What's going on, guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the channel. Today, I want to talk to you guys about the NX leaks, Nintendo NX leaks. Now, this is some pretty interesting uh, information I came across. I'll definitely put a link in the description for you guys to go over and read yourself. But the information came actually from a video game enthusiast uh, by the name of Liam Robertson, who's uh, he likes to dig deep to find information on video games that have never been released. So. He found a lot of information about the Nintendo NX, and supposedly, if this is going to be believed, the NX is going to be a pretty impressive system. Here's some of the bullet points that they mentioned in this article. Exclusive game franchises, of course, including Mario, Zelda, Donkey Kong, and more. Uh, you can connect with players from around the world using Nintendo's network. Gameplay flows between the NX console and the NX handheld device. You can earn and share gaming achievements, triumphs, and defeats with your gaming friends and the Nintendo gaming community. So they're obviously getting much more uh, into the social aspect of gaming. You can surf the web or make video calls on your TV. That's pretty cool, but that's also letting you know that their controller does have a camera on it. It supports 4K, 60 frames per second streaming. So that's a little bit different. And also the gameplay graphics will be at 900p, 60 frames per second. So what does this mean? All right, uh, As far as hardware goes, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, for the most part, have major issues running games at 1080p 60 frames per second. Like it says in this article, a majority of the games that PlayStation 4 and Xbox One run at that frame rate are usually games that have been remastered, remakes of older games that are not visually very, very stressful to the console. Most games, like even Call of Duty Black Ops 3, it runs at 60 frames per second for multiplayer and 30 to 45 for the single player. Games like Fallout, uh, these games run at 30 frames per second. So for games that are made specifically for the current gen, most of the time you're going to get 30 frames per second. I, I would say games like Horizon Zero Dawn, you're going to get like 30 frames per second out of a game like that. Games like uh, The Order 1886, that game can't run at 60 frames. Look at it. Games that are visually stunning for these current gen consoles can't run at that higher frame rate. So if Nintendo's actually planning on running their games at 900p 60 frames per second for a majority of their library, they're basically saying that they have a really nice chipset in this Nintendo NX. And and based on what I believe Nintendo has learned from this last generation, I think they're going to really go for it when it comes to hardware. I don't think they're going to go super far in, into the future, but I think they're going to be ahead of the PS4 and the Xbox One. Because just think about it, the Wii was behind the PlayStation 3 and the Xbox 360. The Wii U is behind the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One. I think that the Nintendo NX needs to, for once, be ahead. It sounds like it can actually be ahead. The other big thing in these bullet points, 4K streaming at 60 frames per second. That's really unheard of. Uh, and that means it would have to use uh, HDMI 2.0. And that's something that's far in the future. So I would really be uh, excited to see what this thing is. Uh, I think the Nintendo NX could potentially be, you know, Nintendo's great comeback. It's very, very possible and feasible. Nintendo is Looking at all their the L's they've been taking for the last couple of years, and they're like, I don't want to lose anymore. I want to I want to do something to bring my fans back. Imagine having an open world Mario game that looks better than what we're seeing on PS4 and the Xbox One right now. Imagine having a Zelda game that actually lives up to the visual standards of today's technology, and and runs at 60 frames per second, 900p. I wouldn't mind 900p if their standard is 900p, 60 frames for all their games. Holy crap! But then again, if they're just, and this is what they're wishing for, this is what they're hoping for, and they fall short, then they're going to fall short. Hopefully, Nintendo NX does come out and it does break new ground. Nintendo, to me, is known as a company that revolutionizes gaming. They brought out the first analog sticks, the first rumble packs. You know, Nintendo, they always change something up. They were the first company to revolutionize uh, uh, motion controls with the Nintendo Wii. And of course, it was a gimmick, but, you know, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Everything they tried, everybody else has emulated. So hopefully they're going to do something really, really big with the NX. You guys let me know in the comments, are you excited about the NX? Do you think that 4K streaming and 60 frames per second is pretty impressive? Would you like a console that plays all their games in 900p, 60 frames? I would. I think that would be really, really awesome. You guys let me know what you think in the comment box below. Be sure to give a thumbs up, show support for my channel, and definitely subscribe. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time. Hey, Carl.